balancing magical powers while fighting evil, season three of Charmed is underway right here on The CW. And joining us this morning, we have actress Sarah Jeffrey, who plays Maggie Vera, and actor Jordan Donica, who plays Jordan Chase. Welcome, both of you. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? We're doing good. It's good to have you guys on. Now, in this season on Charmed, we find three sisters juggling their duties as witches and then their real lives. So Maggie, Sarah, I should say, uh, what is that like? Um, I think for the Charmed ones, Maggie included, it's always a struggle to find the witch life balance and wanting to save the world, but also wanting to have some semblance of a normal life, which is also even more difficult this season because we have this magical allergy, which is um, was the which was the writer's way of um, kind of incorporating social distancing um, and the whole COVID aspect of things into the show. Um, so there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff happening um, for Maggie. She's really focusing on herself and um, year of me, she calls it. Uh, she's in school for psych, which is something she's always wanted to do and kind of ties into her empathic powers. Um, and then, yeah, there's the relationship with her sisters and with Jordan and mm -hmm. lots of question marks in the air. <laughs> Yeah, I want to talk about that. So your character, Maggie, and then Jordan's character have this will they or will they not get together type of relationship. Are we going to find out a little bit more about that? Jordan? Yeah, I think so. Uh, it's their I like their relationship a lot because it's mature. You know, they're friends. They're, they're, there's not, you know, jealousy is an ugly thing. And uh, they don't really lead with those kinds of negative um, emotions or thoughts because because of I think the life experiences that they both had uh, mm -hmm. being young adults not a lot of young adults go through the magic the, the things that Maggie Vera has saved how many times has she saved the world and she hasn't even graduated college yet um, and so that's something I think that is yeah. a strength is something that, that Jordan is really drawn to and yeah, Jordan has it too hmm. Jordan's very as well you know he was a vet basically right so now you are as you're studying one of your professors makes things a little more difficult but you're still determined to get that psychology degree right yeah absolutely i mean girl power she's uh, i think something i love about maggie's arc throughout the seasons is she's just gained a lot of confidence in herself um and i think a lot of that has been just regular life experience but also she's like saving the world so i don't think she's afraid of some kind of chauvinistic mansplainer right um and she still fully intends to excel um and get her psych degree and jordan you've been pulled into this world of witches but you're a law school trying to get in with a good firm and they're not always doing the right things that go along with your beliefs so how do you get through that yeah so that's a that's an interesting struggle with with the idea of being a corporate lawyer and um jordan i think as, as we as we see throughout the this particular season he um he ha he decides to, that he wants to start a legal clinic uh legal immigration clinic at safe space uh to help uh usher in um, an easier pathway to citizenship for immigrants to the u.s which i think is a very important um, topic of conversation right now yeah um and we get to see that explored in jordan's backstory uh back in episode nine that also has to do with his curse in nice. terms of his relationship with his translator and why is he so hellbent why is he so um, why is he so um, wrapped up in this this idea of being a lawyer to help people right. um, and what happens when you come up against a type of law that you know when the thing that you thought you wanted isn't doesn't turn out to be what you thought it would be. You guys, thanks so much for being on uh, Charm Season 3, moving to its new time slot, 8 p.m. right here on The CW. Good to see you both. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Take care.